Hello and welcome to Think TV. In this video we will cover on why North Korea will never start a war. North Korea's leadership and nuclear program have made it a controversial topic for several decades, and many people are concerned about the possibility of North Korea starting a war. However, in this video, we will explore why this is unlikely to happen. Firstly, North Korea's military is aware of its limitations. North Korea does have a significant military presence, with around 1.2 million active duty soldiers and an additional 7.7 .7 million reserves. However, it is widely recognized that North Korea is outmatched by the military capabilities of other major world powers, such as the United States. North Korea's equipment is outdated, and its troops are poorly trained and poorly fed. Any attack by North Korea would likely result in devastating retaliation, and the North Korean leadership is well aware of this fact. Furthermore, North Korea is heavily reliant on trade with other countries, particularly China. In 2020, China accounted for over 90% of North Korea's external trade. A significant conflict with any country could potentially lead to economic sanctions that would further isolate North Korea and significantly harm its economy. North Korea's leadership is also aware of this fact and, as a result, is unlikely to jeopardize its economic ties by starting a war. Another factor that makes it unlikely for North Korea to start a war is the potential impact on its citizens. North Korea has a population of around 25 million people, who are already living in difficult conditions. The North Korean regime has been accused of several human rights violations, but even with that said, the country's leadership is unlikely to put its own people in harm's way by starting a war. Any conflict would inevitably lead to civilian casualties and destruction, which is something the regime would want to avoid. Additionally, the North Korean leadership is well aware of the potential for a mass exodus of citizens if a war were to break out, which could destabilize the regime. Finally, North Korea is also aware of the significant international attention and condemnation it would receive if it started a war. North Korea's leaders have previously been heavily criticized for their human rights record and nuclear program, and starting a war would only serve to increase that scrutiny. The international community would undoubtedly come together to condemn any unprovoked attack by North Korea, and this is not something the regime would want. The North Korean regime has historically used saber-rattling as a tool to gain concessions from the international community, rather than as a prelude to war. In conclusion, while North Korea's leadership may make threatening statements and engage in provocative behavior, it is unlikely to start a war. The country is aware of its military limitations, economic vulnerabilities, potential impact on its citizens, and the international condemnation it would face. For these reasons, we can be reasonably confident that North Korea will continue to prioritize its own self-preservation over starting a war. That's all for this video. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe and share to your friends. It really helps out a lot.